Hello and welcome everyone to another unoriginal intro by yours truly. It shouldn't come as a surprise that this is another battles video, because what else am I going to do? But do not, I repeat do not give me suggestions for games to upload because I will never end up playing them anyways. I've gotten bored of pretty much every other game that isn't League or Balloons, so personally I don't see the point in me uploading videos of games I won't even enjoy playing, it'll just end up being a train wreck of a video void of any jokes. With that said it was revealed a few weeks ago that Ninja Kiwi is working on a mobile version of Balloons Super Monkey 2, no estimated time of arrival other than in a few months. So I guess that will coincide with the release of Battle Steam. Definitely looking forward to those games when it comes out, but until then we'll have to learn to control our hormones. Anyways, in the background is just a random batch of R3 speed games that I played a few days ago. I've been a bit busy lately so for now I'm kind of holding back on the really awesome videos I plan to do when I get the time to edit them, hint hint. So yeah. I was kind of zoned out during these games so don't blame me for playing like complete ass in them, I guess part of the reason I was so laid back was cause none of them had good records, so I could afford to dick around and not get screwed over doing that. So yeah, this second game isn't actually on R3 speed, instead it's a mega boost game on BFB Coliseum. Oh wait, it's a normal battle arena on Ceramic Crucible. That's weird because I distinctly remember having pressed BFB Coliseum, as proof, let me show you the screen capture. Damn, after the 3.4 update I was sure they would fix this glitch cause it's super annoying and seems to happen really freaking often, as for game breaking I don't think so, but still, on a few occasions like this one, I chose my towers thinking it was a mega boost game rather than a normal one and played like it was a different arena too. Only then once I pressed those tower and balloon boost did I realize that was going on, ha ha, the opponent must have been thinking I was boosted or something when I did that. Anyways, on to some non-gameplay related shit. I want to bring up something regarding an obviously sarcastic joke I made last video, or at least I thought was obvious. To refresh your minds. Somewhere in the middle of the video I mentioned that I didn't have a preference to what my favorite season was because I was always in my basement 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, 30 days a month, 400 days a year, and 100 years a decade. And so a few of you smart asses thought I was an idiot and corrected me by saying, I sub senpai, there are only 10 years in a decade and not 100. Come on guys. Don't mean to be rude to the people who said that but do you really think I am that brainless? Although it's true I simply could have made a mistake or something like that, I thought it was 110% obvious I was just being sarcastic because I just said 400 days in a year the moment before, yet none of you acknowledged the fact I said that, it just seemed to glaze over your heads. So remember guys, next time I say something stupid, it probably means it was just a prank. Before I move on to the next segment, let's just gather the results from the very segment that sparked those comments, the poll. So apparently a lot of you like summer, I'm presuming that's because it's the season where people wear the least amount of clothing, and you know what that means. You get to stare at those tits, legs and ass. Let's face it guys, we all know that's the reason everyone loves summer. On the other hand a decent chunk seem to like winter too, probably cause everyone wants their annual gift of coal from Santa. There can't be a more fitting time for today's poll, so without further ado the question is, tits or ass? No in between, no both, no neither. It's either one or the other. Moving on, I'd also like to address a few of the following comments I've gotten lately. It goes something along the lines of, Hey I sub I literally just played you in XXX Arena and beat you on round 2, colon D. I would post the comments here but I'm too lazy to search for them because they're all over the place, and some of them date back to weeks and months ago. But let me just bring up the fact that there are over 20 people who named themselves I sub in battles, 
probably even more than that because I last checked the count with Ninja Kiwi over a month ago. So with that said, before you comment saying you played me, how about you verify that you played with a real one first? The real one should have YT and a colon in the name now, with around an 85 to 90% win rate on top of 400,000 medallions or so. Would have been easier to determine if you could see the damn wins and losses, yet another reason it was a stupid change. But yeah, there was an instance where there was a dude called Isop with really similar stats, so I wouldn't fault you if that was the case. As a matter of fact that guy was at the top of the leaderboards for quite some time, so thanks for the free plug I guess. But really, most ISUB imitators will not have the same stats as me so it should be easy peasy to distinguish. My job is done for today, for the 400th time I thank you all for watching. Before leaving though make sure to exercise your right hand by moving your mouse over to the rating, sub, and comment buttons. Have a sake day, and don't for a moment think I will forget about that.